So, hello everybody. In this video, I will show you how to use my business process wizard. I will be using mock REST API for managing vacations. And next, I prepared two data objects in Business Central, the first one for vacation request and the second one for vacation. So let's begin. Choose new business process, check use wizard, name it request confirmation. Okay. On the first page I see process name and process de description. I am fine with default values. I continue to the second page. Here I should specify information necessary for the process start. In my case, is it the request for the vacation? I can continue on this page. I can specify the process start. I find that my process will start immediate, immediately, so I can continue to the next page. Here I can upload definition of any REST API. Uh, in my case, I will upload my definition of API for vacations. So I've chosen the file. Uh, in the results, I see the API name and version. And now I can specify process tasks. So the first task will create request on the server. Then this request will be verified by some human. And then request will be confirmed or declined. So the red core is telling me that something is wrong. I have to provide more details. The first task we will call operation query request with the request from the process inputs. And I want to store output of this operation. Now I can reverse this output in next task. I want to see created vacation as input and I want to store my decision about request to the variable name confirmed and I will assign this task to myself. Okay. Uh, I want to decide about these two tasks according to the decision stored in previous task. So I merge merge them with condition. The first task, I don't want to continue after this task. Uh, operation confirm will be called with the ID of created vacation. The same here. I don't want to continue. I want to decline vacation with the ID of, of created vacation. And the last thing. I have to specify condition. So if the decision was true, I want to confirm. Otherwise, I want to decline. Finish. Now I see the process. The process form was generated automatically. I have to generate only form for human task. Uh, in this quick example, I don't want to deal with subforms, so I delete this field. Save, and now I can. Yeah, here we go. All right. Successful. I can create a new instance. Okay. So the reason for vacation other length, let's say two weeks, it can be unpaid. I can check that correct data was sent to the server. Yeah, a few seconds ago was done post. And here are data. And now use the task for verification assigned to myself so I will confirm this request uh, confirm so 
and I can check that the request was confirmed. A few seconds ago, confirm revocation request. So that's it. That's how to use my business process wizard. Thank you for watching.